Hello and welcome. In this video I want to cover how you can streamline your reporting and board reporting uh, processes in particular. So here we see a typical Excel uh, report but as opposed to the normal situation where data is pasted in Excel and stored in Excel all data here is stored um, on the central database which is uh, either Power BI or uh, a SQL database and with the Ectaris add-in uh, you can manage the user rights to this um, report so the users will only see what they're allowed to see so for example only the organizations that they have access to will show up here now and if I don't have access to some of the organizations um, I won't see them but if I want to switch you now to Australia I can just select it and we'll then see the data for this uh, country. So here you can see now the updated data. Um, and it's not just the read of data, but uh, you can also write back data. So for example, if I want to now for budgeting purpose, increase this uh, number. I can now just turn on the uh, edit for this report, put in my new number and then uh, I, I could enter also multiple numbers so I can say I also know that the other income here will change and then all these changes will be recorded so you have an audit trail of what has happened I could even undo these transactions if I wanted to and if this is all okay I can just commit the changes back to the central server. So here we see now the updated data and we can see the, the value on the total that we changed was automatically allocated to all the underlying detail accounts. And this is not just here, but this will be anywhere. So this is in the central server. If you use this report, for example, with Power BI, or if you have a different report layout that we can see here with our formula report, we see the value was equally updated here where the data is not coming through a pivot table but is coming through formula so if I click on a formula here I can see what details are retrieved here the benefit is of total flexibility and how I create this report you can see here I've got uh, calculations uh, I've got a few other things here so here I have total flexibility to create the report exactly as I want to plus also visualizations and sparklines and so on and it uh, would also affect whatever other reports we have. So we can see we also have a sales report. We also have an ESG report that covers environmental, social and governance factors. And so now the question is, okay, I've got now a way more efficient um, spreadsheet here with a single workbook. My entire company can get exactly the data that they need, their audit trails there if something gets changed this is automatically an audit trail on the central server where I can see I've changed this value from this to that. I've got security a key aspect as well where despite everyone using the same workbook they will only be allowed to see what they're allowed to see and they can only write where they're allowed to write. But now I would like to make this available to my board and then typically it gets very cumbersome if you have to create a uh, you know, separate board report. But this can be now completely automated as well. So here I have now a template, which is just a normal Word document. But as opposed to having data here as hard-coded, I have a link here. So all the relevant details are linked here. And that also includes the charts from the spreadsheet that you just saw before. It includes key numbers that I'm referring to, the report that you just saw before. And all this will automatically update. So the only thing I have to do is just click here on update and it will automatically take the, the version of the data that's in the database that I can see here as well. And it will automatically update this with the filters that I can select here. So if I want to produce the board report for Adventure Work Cycle in a particular quarter, I just select these details and this will automatically reflect through in the board report. So 
can see then I will automatically see these results. Um, and then I can either make it available as a Word document or if I want to save it as a locked copy. So if I want to keep the numbers as they are and without interference, because obviously the data here will change. So if the data on the server changes, the data will change here as well. We just saw it updating. But if I want to keep this exactly as is, I can just save a locked copy, which is just in a PDF document or a Word document where the links are frozen. So they won't update anymore, even if the data has changed. And you can have exactly the data as you, uh, as it was at this point in time, but without any efforts. So the board report here is completely automatically produced. What you can always do, you can change your uh, comments here. They would be stored uh, again in the document. Um, but otherwise, everything is completely automatically updated. So we hope uh, you like this quick overview of how you can make your reporting more efficient, how you can add planning capabilities to a central server, and how you can then use completely automated board reporting. For any further questions, please visit our website and speak to one of our friendly customer success consultants.